بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم ان شاء الله now we will start uh, revising the first lesson in chapter uh, 13 technology what is the meaning of technology okay we said technology means using science to solve problems okay what does that mean okay we said long time ago people didn't have any cars so they went uh, to school on on their feet okay they went from place to place, okay, on in, and on their feet, or uh, they were using bikes or things like that. But scientists used science to solve this problem, okay? Scientists tried to think and think and think and think how we can solve this problem, okay? After that, they invented cars. So now we are using cars, okay? So cars are a kind of technology why because we use science to make cars okay so when you are using science to make anything this is technology when you are using science to solve a problem and make new things okay this is technology so again what is technology technology is using science to solve problems okay i need you all to say after me technology Technology. 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 Yes. Technology. 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 Technology.
Okay, so again, transportation is the way you move from one place to another place. Some, something that makes you move from one place to another place, okay? So, hello, Ahmed. Yes, teacher. Are cars means of transportation? Yeah. Yes. Why? Because cars makes you cars make you move from one place to another place, right? Okay. Yes, because cars make you move from one place to another place, right? Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay, excellent. Okay. Lujain. Yes. Are boats means of transportation? Transportation, can, yes. Okay, can boats yes. uh, make uh, can boats make you move from one place to another place? Yeah. Yeah, so it is a uh, yes. So the boats are means of transportation. Okay. Transportation. So again, what is the meaning of transportation? Transportation is the way you move from one place to another place. Say after me, the way you move from one place to another place. The way you move from one place to another place. Excellent. Okay. Okay, we said that long time ago, they used engines called steam engines, okay? What is the meaning of engine, teacher? Engine is a machine, okay, that can make objects move. Okay. So, engine is a machine, engine does work, and engine also can make objects move. Like what? Like your father's car. Your father's car has an engine inside it, okay? The engine makes your father's car move, okay? So engines are machines, engine uh, does work, engine also uh, makes object move, okay? Or make, makes object move, okay? So long time ago, they invented a kind of engines called steam engine. Again, long time ago, they invented a kind of engines called steam engine. Okay, so Minna. Yes, teacher. This engine is called what, Minna? Steam engine. Super, this is steam engine. Excellent. So, long time ago, they invented steam engines. Steam engines were not very fast. So, they, the scientists, uh, wanted to invent another engine that are fast, okay? So the scientists after that, also the steam engine uh, were used in steam trains, okay? After that, scientists, the scientists made the gasoline engine, okay? So first we had steam engine, after that, gasoline engine so this is what this is gasoline engine okay maria mohsen maria mohsen this is gasoline engine gasoline engine the gasoline engine is the engine in your father's car okay uh, mariam can you tell me that a gasoline engine causes what cause of pollution Excellent. The gasoline engine causes pollution, and this is very bad. So scientists tried to solve this problem. So they invented new engine. This new engine is the electric engine. So this is the electric engine. Okay. So Rudaina. Rudaina. Rudaina, this, this is which engine? The steam engine. No, this is not the steam. The steam is the old one. We said first, okay, we had the steam engine, then gasoline engine, then this is the electric engine. This is the very new engine, okay? So this is the? Electric engine. Excellent. This is the electric engine. Okay. Maria Muhammad Ali? Yes. Okay, Mariam. Now we said long time ago we had which kind of engine? Mm. Steam. 
steam engine, okay? Steam so one engine. time again ago, we had steam engine, okay? After that, okay. scientists made what? This is what? Hala. Gasoline engine. Excellent. This is gasoline engine. But gasoline engine, Hala, causes what? Uh, I forget. Uh, is that pollution? And pollution. Yes, the gasoline engine causes pollution. Okay, so the scientists invented electric engine. Okay, technology can keep us safe by what? By using seat belts, as you see here, and also by using the airbags in your father's car. Okay, airbags can also keep you safe okay so let's start our lesson today okay our today's lesson is how can technology help us technology can help people stay healthy how by making vaccines by making vaccines say after me vaccine 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 Vaccine. Technology can help people stay healthy by making vaccine. Okay, what is vaccine? Vaccine is a medicine. Okay, this medicine can stop disease. Okay, or can stop viruses. Okay, but this vaccine cannot cure disease. What does that mean? Okay, if you took a vaccine, this vaccine will protect you from viruses, okay? Will protect you from diseases. But if you are sick, okay? Or if a man is sick and this man went to the doctor, okay? The doctor will not give this man vaccine. Why? Because the vaccine will not do anything, okay? So if the man is already sick, the vaccine will not make the man good again. No, the vaccine only protects you before the virus comes okay so vaccine is a medicine that can prevent disease not cure disease okay again vaccine is a medicine that can prevent disease stop disease not cure disease so vaccine is a medicine that can prevent disease vaccine is a medicine that can prevent disease okay do you remember in grade one all of you had a vaccine right to protect you from viruses, okay? Okay, technology can help people to see well. Technology can help people see well. How, teacher? By using glasses or by using contact lenses, okay? So again, technology can help people see well. How? By using glasses or by using contact lenses. So. If a man cannot see well, he can put on glasses or contact lenses, okay? So, technology can help people to see well. Why? By what? By, say after me, by using glasses. And, uh, say after me, by using glasses. And contact lenses. Glasses and contact lenses. Okay. Now, doctors use technology to help people see well. Okay, so doctors use technology to help people hear well. How? By using hearing aids. Hearing aids are devices that people use to hear well. Okay, so again, technology can help people hear well. How? By using hearing aids by using hearing aids. By using what? Hearing, hearing aids. aids. Hearing, hearing aids. aids. Hearing aids, okay? I'm sure that all of you have watched up cartoon, right? This man was using hearing aids so he can hear well, okay? Okay. Also technology can help some people walk. Some people, okay uh had accidents okay so okay or they lose their legs so 
technology help them walk by using artificial legs by using artificial legs artificial legs are not real legs no they are not real but they put this artificial legs so they can walk so technology can help some people walk by using artificial legs say after me artificial legs Technology can help some people walk by using artificial legs. Okay. 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 Technology also can help doctors see inside your body. How is that? Okay. This is called x ray. This is it. the x ray can help see a uh, doctor see your bones okay so selma yes this is called what x-ray uh, yes x-rays the x-rays can help people see our bones yes see your bones excellent oh, okay so other there are other tools are this tool and this tool this tool is called cat scan one is called cat scan one is called mri one is called cat scan say after me cat scan say after me cat scan cat scan cat scan cat scan CAT scan and MRI. 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 So the last CAT scan MRI. Can the CAT scan and MRI allow doctors to see inside your body? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Zainab. Hi, Zainab. Okay. Hi, teacher. Hi, Zainab. So we said, Zainab, that there are some tools that can make doctors see inside your body. Zainab, what is this? Is it the X-ray? Zaina, is that the X-ray? Okay, so that is the X-ray. The X-rays allow doctors to see your bones, okay? Also, we have the CAT scan and the MRI, okay? They are tools that can uh, make doctors see inside your body and no, uh, and see what's wrong with you okay 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 girls till here we finished our lesson